Hey, what is up, guys? I hope that all of you are doing well. So, today in this video, I will show you some of the translation features of the Samsung Galaxy AI that we have just received with these new updates. For that, you will have to make sure that your device is on the latest One UI 6.1 version, and you can check that by simply going into your settings and then software update, and then you have to select download and install. As you can see, I'm on the latest One UI 6.1 version with the 1st October 2024 security patch. Now, if you will swipe down in the control center, you will get to see this new interpreter option. And when you will click on this interpreter option, you will get to see these two modes of conversation mode and listening mode. If we first select the listening mode, so in this mode, your device will only listen and whatever the other person is speaking, that will be translated. As you can see, whatever the other person is speaking, it is translating that. And the next mode that we have is the conversation mode. By going into these three dots, you will get to see this conversation mode. And in this conversation mode, if you're talking to someone who do not speak your language and they do not speak your language, then you're in their language voice will be translated using this Galaxy AI interpreter option. Also, you can change the languages by simply clicking on this option. To select any other language, you will have to download the language pack as you can see over here. There are multiple language packs available to download. Also, if you have already downloaded a language pack, the updates also come. You can download the language pack according to your need. So do try out this feature as it is a must have if you travel a lot. Next up, in the call application, you get to see this live call translation mode by simply going into your settings and then select live translate. So this live translate is also quite similar you will get to see a live call translation of your and their language both languages will be translated breaking all the language barriers you can also select multiple languages over here like you can select your own language then you have to select the language of the other person after selecting both the languages your live call translation will be activated for this you have to download the language pack as well as you can see over here there are multiple language packs available and once downloaded you are good to go and now with the new update you get to see this new option of live translate in other apps so if you're talking in some other apps like whatsapp google meet messenger or instagram you can enjoy this live call translation feature on these apps as well for that you just have to swipe down and go to your control center as the animation is showing you simply you have to scroll down and you will get to see a live translate option over here this will break all the language barriers if you're talking to someone who do not speak your language Next up, we have another useful translate feature. So if you are on a website that is not in your language, so you just have to long press your home button and select this icon. And using this, the language that is not in your language, that will be translated in your language. You can also select the languages from here as well. As you can see, you can select both the detected language and the translate to language as well. And next up, we have another feature that you guys might be missing out and that is with the new circle to search feature, you get to see this new music icon. And using this music icon, you can identify any song that is playing in your background. So if a song is playing in your background and you want to identify it, so simply you have to long press your home button and then select this music icon and that song will be identified using the Google. And that's a wrap for today's video. Check out these translation features and do let me know in the comment section that which feature you like the most. Also, do let me know in the comment section that are you facing any better in issues with this new update. And if you're new on the channel, so make sure to like and subscribe as I will keep you updated with the new updates.